Did you know in Pokemon Scarlet and Violet there's a place called Picnic Knacks and you could like buy things for your picnic? I didn't know until I beat the game. So I bet a lot of you don't know either. Maybe you do because you're probably smarter than me. Uh, anyways, uh, you could buy like tablecloths and balls and uh, bottles and cups and stuff. Yeah, so I'm going to do a tier list and we're going to be ranking them all by my opinions only uh, aesthetics because you can't eat it or drink it or uh, do anything with it besides look at it. So it's visual only, eyeball only. This is a uh, A, B, C, D, E eyeball. Huh? This is an A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H eyeball conversation. So I would like you to see cucumber your way out of here. <coughs> Excuse me. So without further ado, let's get started, brothers. Start with number one. Let's get the little uh, picture out here. We're gonna start with the Academy Tablecloth. Okay, so upon further uh, inspections, this thing doesn't look entirely bad. It's not like garbage garbage, but uh, that's what I think about it, honestly. Uh, it's just like, I mean, it's not that bad. The tablecloth itself isn't bad. So I think we're going to put this in a big fat C tier to start off with. A big fat C tier. The Academy Tablecloth is a good starter. Um, uh, other than that, uh, it, it's it's like a good in-betweener. Like, you know, it's a good starting kit. Like, you start at the Academy and then you forget that you have to go to school in this game. It's like that. You forget about this tablecloth is what I'm trying to say here. Now, it's not the most forgettable on this list, but it definitely is a forgettable one right it's like a c it's a perfect c really it's just average it's there to be a tablecloth it does its job it doesn't make you go "Ooh, that's a tablecloth it's not like i want to eat there you know what i'm saying like if you saw this tablecloth and there was food on the table you'd obviously eat because you're hungry if you saw this tablecloth and there was food on there you wouldn't be opposed to eating food but on the other hand um, if there was like a hot dog that's been sitting on the tablecloth on the table for like, I don't know, three hours and you were hungry, you'd be like, mm, you know what, never mind. You know, like if you were starving in a desert and this is the first thing you'd see, you'd maybe think about it, it'd maybe cross your head. But at the same time, if you were like a little bit, like, if you were just a little bit satisfied and you could eat and you saw this tablecloth, you wouldn't eat anything on top of it. You know what I'm saying? You know, so it's a, cl it's a classic C. <laughs> Let's go to the next one before I lose my fucking mind. This one's the whimsical. Uh, it's very, I'm getting, it's giving, um, little cutesy Pokemon. It's giving, uh, drop ketchup on it and you ruin the whole tablecloth. Other than that, I mean, I probably wouldn't ever use this again in game, but that's just me. Maybe I'd get it, say, if, like, my significant other or someone wanted a tablecloth and they just so happened to see it on Etsy or something, which I'll never find. Or if I'm, like, walking through the aisles of Target for a tablecloth and all of a sudden I see this, I'd be like, oh, Maybe I'd pick it up. But other than that, I mean, I like how it shows Pokemon and it shows flowers. I don't fucking know. Either way, they got flowers and they got Pokemon. What else could you ask for? It's cute, but it's cute. But my male brain is telling me that I won't ever use this. So I think we're going to put this in the D tier. To be honest, I'd use the Academy tablecloth more than the Whimsical tablecloth. <laughs> Say it ain't so, I will not go, turn the lights off, carry me home. Next one's the leafy, leafy, this leafy one, I like it a lot more than the, uh, you know, this is just screaming B to me, this is screaming B. I'm just, there's a B? Like, I'm just getting B tier from this one on quad. Okay, oh gee, I'm getting B from this. I like the green, I like the dark green, I like the light green, I like the light light green, you know, I like the kind of cyan green with one of the vines and the dark green for the other vine. 
kind of like an olive drab kind of and then like the lime light lime kind of neon kind of lime 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 uh i like those <laughs> this one i know i gave the other whimsical one some shit i mean like i understand i gave the whimsical one but that one looked like a little baby's diaper diapy diaper, and i don't like that i don't want to eat on a baby's diaper that's fucking disgusting and rancid and this one's got like kind of like a foresty vibe to it and when you're picnicking you're outside you know you're in the wilderness maybe a wilderness vibe so like i i can I, 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 b tier you know it's a b tier i like this one you know maybe i'd use it again maybe probably not though maybe <laughs> next up we have the spooky tablecloth let's get this one riled up the spooky tablecloth honestly i think this one might be hitting in our a tier first glances it might be a tier i like the kind of silhouette -y kind of pokemon icons it reminds me of pokemon trozy troze whatever you fucking call it pokemon puzzly pokemon kakali pokemon look inside the toilet and see a shit that's <laughs> That's the version I'm getting here. Pokemon look down the uh Pokemon look down the sink drain and see a Sableye holding the one piece of corn I forgot to eat. And I, I think it's an A, to be honest. I think this is an A. I'm I'm feeling A on this one. On God. On G. I like the Gengar faces. It's a nice dark purple dark navy. That's gonna suck later. And I like the accents of the red, the yellow, the pink. The blue, the purpley, yellow, red for the mischievous, mischievous. Every fucking time I say that wrong. I, I like it. I like it a lot. I think it's an A tier. I would use this again on on Jesus Christ, our Father, Lord of the Fathers. I don't know when this video is coming out. Maybe it'll be on Jesus Christ Day. I don't know why I keep going on with this. We're going to stop talking. Anyways, this one's looking pretty good. I would use this shit again. Uh, cheers, love. Uh, we give this one an A tier. An easy fat A tier for this one. Oh, oh yeah, A robo. A tier, mate. Let's go to the plaid boy. Any plaid boys, mate? Okay, now we're getting into the real life ones. Now this looks like something that came out of me after I've waited 20 minutes in line at Chipotle. They said that they didn't have any white rice and then they scraped the bottom of the fucking white rice tub or whatever the fuck it's called and they put that shit in there and then I bit into it, it broke all of my teeth and they and it's just rice and then i got that stupid little guacamole tip you know the little stupid guacamole butthole you know the little black brown tip of it you know what i'm trying to say we're like where, where the little vine or whatever grew it from that's the thing i'm talking about i'm thinking about that that thing just when you bite into that shit it just ruins your entire Chipotle experience. And on top of that, you're already spending like $13 for a fucking bowl that you could just get like... You could go to fucking Target, Publix, uh, Ralph's, wherever. You could go... Who cares? And you can get your freaking lean ground beef. You can make your own freaking burritos and bowls and shit for less money. This looks like the throw up in my bowl when i eat a hard piece of a soft food you know what i'm saying this is what you see in the diaper when you wake up to change your baby this looks like baby shit this is what you see when you wake up and you see shit and vomit on the couch because you fed your dog one too many mcdonald's fries okay this is what's happening here i don't like i okay hear me out the yellow and orange combo, it reminds me of Trix yogurt. You guys remember those Trix yogurts with the little swirly swirls? It's got cool color combos. I hate the way it's given. The plaid looks like Gaka. I hate it. Let's get this out of here, please. This shit is a D tier. I hate this. D tier, we've ranted too much. Let's go to the plaid blue tablecloth. Okay, okay. This one's kind of got like a 3D effect to it. I like how it looks. The plaid's a little bit better. It's a little different. You know, I think this is more of like a nostalgic picnic type. This is like something you'd buy at a good store. Like maybe you'd go to, I don't know, the Gucci store. Got my Gucci on. I could have my Louis Vuitton. This is what I'm getting here. 
this looks pretty good. You know what? This is like a C tier. You know what? You put this on and then you'd be fine with it. You just forget about it. Like if you just say you pl put this on before you stop playing this game for a year and you come back to this game for some God unknown God knows reason after a year. So in 2024, you come back, you left this one on and you come back, you'd be like, I forgot you could change the picnic tables. Like you just forget. You just have this on and you'd be like, oh, okay, whatever. It's just a game. C tier. Let's go to the red tablecloth. You know what? This one looks like a flannel you buy at, uh, I don't know, a place with a thrift stop. Thrift, thrift stop. Yeah, a thrift stop. Dumbass. A thrift shop, okay? It's plaid. You can't get any more fucking basic than this shit. It's got blue, though, and it's usually just red and black or gray and red, gray, white, black. Not blue or light blue. This is C, though. We're not going to go too far into this one because it's literally just a fucking plaid. Like, I could just... I could go to Joanne Fabrics right now and get a swab of fabric that looks exactly like this. Thank you. Goodbye. See you next year. Battle. Okay, now we're going somewhere. Okay, this one, is, there's a lot going on in this one, okay? Oh, it has my favorite Pokemon. It really does. It's got Zoroark. I mean, I'm a fan. One, two, three, four, five. I can see six, maybe. It doesn't matter, though. We're just counting because we like to count. Like, I just learned how to count yesterday. Uh, there's just a lot going on. There's, like, Pokeballs in the back that are exploding. And then there's just, like, electricity, I guess. Yellow, like, strokes coming around. And then the red of the Zoroark clashes with it, which is cool. And it grabs your attention first. And then it's just kind of muddy diarrhea everywhere else. Because Luxray and Lucario are basically blue and yellow and black. And that's all this basically is, except for the Zoroark red. If they didn't have that Zoro arc red, this would be fucking garbage. I think this is, honestly, this is going to be controversial as fuck. I think this is a D tier. I would never use this because of how fucking ugly it looks. It looks like I throw up. It looks like I vomit. I am vomiting from it. D tier. I could have my Gucci on. This one is a monstrous. It's got a Tyranitar. It's got a Noivern. It's got a Hydreigon. It's got a Salamence. There's only four Pokemon it features, which is, a, it's cool, it's simple. Maybe it's like dissecting them, like, oh, this part of the Tyranitar you could use as like a seasoning. Those could also be maybe for like, you eat the bone marrow out of the hands and the Noivern wings. It's like, well, that's cartilage. So maybe it's not for food. I was going to keep going on it, like as if like, this is a good cut of a Tyranitar, this is a good cut of a Noivern, then you could eat the shit up. Because it is a picnic table, but now that I think about it, they're really showing like the shit parts. I think they have a part of the Neuvern though, like a knee. Maybe it could be a leg, but I don't think a knee is good to eat. I mean, a Tyranitar tail, it looks a little spiky, but a Salamence tail, you might be able to cut that shit off like a Slowpoke tail and eat that shit for brunch. But other than that, I like this one. Uh, this one's a B tier. B tier for sure. Uh, we like it. It's good. Uh, I'd probably use it, but... You know, it's not my favorite favorite, you know? I could have my Louis Vuitton. Next one, <laughs> striped tablecloth. I mean, do I have to continue with this one? I like the color combo. It's a C though, cause it's so fucking bland. Let's just fucking skip this one. This one's a C tier. I like the colors, C tier. It's not D because I like the colors. That's the only thing going for it. Let's go for the diamond one next. I don't know about this one. I'm having mixed feelings because it reminds me of a pseudo wudo a little bit or a bonds lie or bonds lee i hate to say it but it looks like baby puke or baby diarrhea i don't know what to say man i do like the contrast with the sylveon that stepped in the fucking way of the shot but um d all right polka dot you know what there's a lot of average ones like this one's average you just put this one on it's just, it's just C. It's a C tier. I don't particularly hate it, and I don't particularly love it. It's just there. It's just a tablecloth. <coughs> where's Lilac? Okay, so first of all, this is where we get into the controversy here. This is definitely not Lilac. This is definitely a Lavender. What color is Lilac specifically? 
Yeah, no, it's not. Yeah, it's way too light for a lilac. Let's look at lavender. Yeah, lavender's way lighter. Lavender's way lighter. This is definitely a lavender, and this is going to be a fucking... This is gonna be a trend. Why the fuck is this lilac? This is lavender. You're so close. This is lavender, bro. And I'll die on this damn hill. This is lavender. This shit is going in D tier because it's fucking false advertising. You know what? We're going to make this into a a whole new tier. This is, no, this is the F tier because it's false advertising. Now, I tried to contain it when I was scrolling through to get to this one. This is not fucking mint, dude. You know what's mint? Them thinking that this is mint. That's mint. That's mint comedy. That's mint. Okay? It's not fucking mint. What color is this? Cyan? This is the fucking color that goes in my damn printer ink. This ain't no mint, dude. You might be thinking, oh, it is. It's not. Look at mint chocolate chip ice cream. That shit's got green to it. This is just blue with the smidge of green. This isn't mint. Okay? Look it up on Google Images. You could do it right now. You know what? I'll make a little Google Image swap. Let's look. What's the first color that comes up when I do when I Google mint color? That shit is fucking green, dude. Okay, if this was mint, this would be A tier. It's not though. It's cyan. False advertising tier. Let's look up peach color because we don't know. Usually when I think of a peach color, it's either orange or it's pink. Okay, and we got a mix of both. It's a very, 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 very light peach. And you know what? I kind of like it. They went bold for this one. When they put peach on this shit, they said, let's add a bunch of white to this pink color and let's just keep doing it. This is an A tier. I would 100% use this again. If not, this might be the best one. You know what? Actually, no, this is an S tier. This is a, this this is the best one so far. Peach has to be the best one so far. This is an S tier classic. It's peach. It's just a light peach. And honestly, light peach, light pink. I love light corals. I love corals. I love pinks, but specifically light pinks. And this one happens to cross both of those lines. This one's an S tier for sure. Wow. Whew! All right, yellow. Yellow's looking good. We like the yellow ones for sure. Yellow is good. We're going to make yellow an A tier. You know what? These ones are simple. They're simple yet effective. This one's yellow. It says what it is. It is what it says. And there it is. You know what you're expecting when you open up the yellow, unlike mint or whatever the fuck the other one was, lilac, who fucking cares? You know what this one is, A tier, yellow. I like yellow, I'm a yellow man. All right, blue, let's go to the blue one. Give me blue. Blue, blue is good. Blue is good. Blue is an A tier, honestly. Blue is an A tier. If I'm feeling a little blue, I throw on the blue picnic table. It's it's getting close to purple, but it is blue. It's a dark blue. It's a nice dark blue. We like dark blues. We like royal blues. This is definitely a nice blue. I would throw this on if I'm feeling that same color like I just said two seconds ago. This is a nice blue. If I'm feeling a little, a little, a little azul, you know, I throw on this. This is nice. A tier for sure. And, oh, mm, no, this isn't the last one. Okay, pink. You know, I did say I don't like the, um, like, I don't really, I didn't say it, but I don't like hot pinks. This one's kind of growing on me. I think this one's a B tier, though. Like, I probably wouldn't use this. It's too hot flamingo, flamingo pink for me, but this is too hot flamingo pink for me, but also, um, I could get down with it. I think it's a B for sure. I think this is a B. Wait, there's a B? Yeah, there's a B for me for sure. Uh, other than I just don't like hot pinks too much, but I think it's a lot better than some of the other ones that they've thrown in this garbage pail. Uh, this one's good. Okay, and there's one more, and it's called Nevermind. It doesn't seem to work. It's called the Nevermind Tablecloth. 
and it's just invisible. <clears throat> okay, it, for some reason, every time you click this never mind tablecloth, it just turns invisible. I, I just, if anyone knows how to get this never mind tablecloth, I wonder what it looks like. I mean, it could be like, like a move, like when a Pokemon uses a, like, like forget a move or something. I think it's a reference to that. Uh, I just... I don't know how to get it to work. If anyone knows how to get this Nevermind tablecloth to work, just tell me in the comments. So yeah, those are the tablecloths. Um, we're gonna throw up to the next one. We're gonna go bottles. But that's for another video. Thank you for watching. <laughs>